Hey guys, welcome back. So I finally finished this, the turd. So, shall we see? There we go. I guess overall I'm pretty happy the way it came out. And uh, so there she is, that's a big one. Let's take a look. Don't have that attached yet, so I can display the pilot. All the missiles did not come with any kind of decal stripes, so I hand painted the stripes and the sidewinders. So there she is, guys. Finally got done. This was a commemorative plane. It was a 75th anniversary of the Oregon National Guard. Um, so it came out of the paint hanger really clean, even though this plane did go to Finland for some training. So there are some YouTube videos of it. Um, I didn't do any, any washing or weathering on it. The only thing that I had issues with was these, these big decals. I did get a little bit of silvering. And you know, depending how much light and how you look at it, it does show up a little bit. I just have to live with that. Um, what I should have done when I cut them out, and, and those of you who are going to build the kit, just a recommendation. There's the decals are quite are pretty thick and there's a lot of carrier film. So what I should have done is, you know, cut the decals out and then trace my knife around, getting rid of a lot of that carrier film because that's what caused it to silver. So, but anyway, I went ahead and put the pilot in. Got him painted up. And my favorite color, blue. So my pilots usually have a blue helmet. <laughs> it's just my little, my trademark. Yeah. Well, there she is, guys. I am uh, really thankful that it's done. Uh, I'm going to move on to something else. Hopefully a little bit more relaxing. And, uh, yeah. So it's got these glass lenses here on the front on the front landing gear but it'll look good in my office and mocha overall looks pretty good there were a lot of stencils so here is the first page of stencils and that's just the top you got some on the side and then the second page of the stencils so a lot of different stencils little bitty things but anyway i did not film the last parts of it or the decals or uh, installing the missiles and stuff i just didn't get that film so just wanted to show you the final reveal and um if you are going to build a kit and use these decals again, I uh, just recommend maybe going around, cutting around with your X-Acto knife. Just put it flat and cut out some of the excess carrier film. Also, you got your, your pedo tubes. Uh, just make sure that, you know, if you put them on first, just put a little slit so they'll fit over the decal or the decal will fit over them so you got two probes on each one probe on each side well guys there should be i know it's been a while modeling's been a little bit slow but uh usually find a couple days a week i can work on my models and we will 
call this one good. Got a little bit of area there. I just need to, looks like something's, anyway, it does fit pretty good. So the canopy will sit right there and I'll glue it down with some white glue and we'll be good to go. All right, guys, I've got a few pictures for you. So stay tuned and I'll see you in the next build. Take care. Bye-bye.